In this video, I'm going to talk about how to use YouTube as an affiliate marketer for beginners to get leads. You see, because I'm seeing a lot of people in affiliate marketing, you know, with classifiedsubmissions.com, I'm getting tons of people promoting affiliate marketing offers and almost none of them are effectively using YouTube and YouTube is one of the best resources for affiliate marketing or really almost selling anything. And I'm finding that the reason people aren't using YouTube is number one, they don't know how to make videos and they're just technically challenged and they, they can't or don't want to learn. I, you can learn how to make videos folks. Um, and another thing is they just don't know what to say or what to talk about. And I'm going to show you solutions to all that. Even if you're someone who's not super technical, even if you're someone who doesn't know what to say, even if you're someone who doesn't speak English as your first language, I'm going to show you just some simple ways to start using YouTube to promote affiliate offers. Okay. The first thing you have to know is that the way to sell anything online, whether it's affiliate offers or anything is by creating an audience. See, I see so many people, they'll put out a few links, they'll post a few links and send out a few emails maybe, but they don't really have an audience. They don't take the time to build an audience. And the reason they don't do it is that it takes time. It takes time to build and building a YouTube channel is a great way to build an audience because you see these links that you're promoting with different affiliate offers, I see people changing them all the time. So you promote something 90% of the time you're promoting their mailing list. And then, uh, they go on to the next one and they promote someone else's mailing list and someone else's video, you see, and they're just constantly starting over. But what if you had a YouTube channel with 5,000 or 6,000 or 10,000 people and a mailing list to boot? you would have an audience that you can market to because everyone is changing their programs all the time. If you, know, if you think you found the one thing that's going to make it for you, the chances are it's not, uh, you're, you're going to be changing. So the, the thing to do is to pick a niche, pick a niche that you're interested in and you want to talk about and start there. But what if you don't know what to talk about? I'm going to show you something. Okay. Here's an article by Neil Patel, who's a really well-known marketer, super successful, and he's a very data driven guy. And he's come down and he's done this uh, article. You're wasting your time creating social media content. You're not wasting your time. And he comes down and say what you should be creating. And there were some really interesting points. I'll put the article below if you want to see all of them, but what uh, um, affect you is you know, what do you talk about? If you're going to do talk about stuff now, whatever your niche is, you got to pick a niche and stick with a niche. Okay. That, that part is important. So I'm going to come down here and he said, tip number two, don't be afraid to have your own opinion. You see what doesn't work a lot of times is just copying what other people are doing and trying to regurgitate it, um, out there. It's already been done it's nothing unique and the algorithms don't usually respond to that too well. But what you can do is you can talk about your experiences. Say you're in affiliate marketing and you suck at affiliate marketing. You could talk about how you suck at affiliate marketing and people will listen to your content. And then you can try different things and you can talk about what you tried, what worked, what didn't, as long as you keep trying things, you could talk about the successes. You could talk about the failures. You could talk about your experiences. So as long as you're doing affiliate marketing and trying affiliate marketing, you can talk about your specific experiences with affiliate, with say the niches, affiliate marketing with affiliate marketing, and you don't have to worry about sucking. Okay. I'm going to show you something else. Okay. This is Mr. Beast. He's the most popular YouTuber with a gab billion zillion followers, whatever. And what his advice is just to make a hundred videos and improve uh, something every single time because your first videos will suck. Okay. My videos aren't that great. All right. They will suck. I'm nowhere near the level of this guy, but that's a joke. Um, so you can't be afraid of sucking. All right. 
because they will suck. Here he says, like, your first video is not going to get views, period. Even the first 10 are not going to get that many views. So you have to have a little bit longer term view to build an audience. And I know everybody wants it all, wants it all right now, but you're just going to chase failure that way. You might as well start building an audience now because tomorrow will come around, next month will come around, and you'll be benefiting it. So you've got to change that mentality from I just want it all right now and I'm desperate to I'm going to build something and a builder mindset. And then you could, that's the true recurring in income. I hardly spent any money in advertising, but because I've built an audience, I'm getting sales every single day, but that took a while to build. So you might as well just start now because that's the way to do it. And you can't worry about being good at first. I'm going to show you something else. Here's something really fascinating that Neil Patel pointed out. And it says that having a lot of fancy editing doesn't really help. It might even hurt. He's saying that videos with minimal to no visual design elements, this basic simple video is kind of like what I'm doing now, um, have the 75% more views and these have only 24%, the ones with lots of visual design. So you don't have to be a fancy editor. It might be better not to do a lot of fancy editing. editing. And I found that on my YouTube journey as well. I've been experimenting with putting my face in the video and putting my face out of the video. I did this one where I put my face in the video and it was terrible. Okay. It was like my worst, worst video that I did. Again, I'm not at the level of, of these guys, but I noticed my videos were doing better, at least for like the, the tutorials. If I, my face wasn't in it because people just want the information. What people want is just good, authentic information. That's why giving your ex uh, experiences are fantastic because that is unique to you. And even if you suck, people will enjoy looking at your videos about you sucking and you're going to develop an audience. And guess what? Eventually you're not going to suck and you get to get better and better. And that's a lot what uh, Mr. Beast was saying. You guys got to dive in. Can't be afraid to, to suck for a while and you'll get better as you go, as long as you can get over that. What if English is not your native language and you want to do something in the English market? Well, here is someone, Dave Nick, a super young guy who has 55,000 subscribers and he's in the make money online market and the guy's brilliant, does a great job, but he has a very heavy accent. He's a real heavy, he speaks English fluently, but he's got a heavy, heavy accent. He's from Serbia, yet he's killing it. So if you can speak English, but you have an accent, don't worry about it. You can, you can go ahead and be super successful. Again, people don't care. They just care if the information is good. That's the most important thing. And if it's authentic, another advantage is if you speak another language, well, you could do videos in that language for that market and there might be less competition. Okay. So you're going to need some software. Basically what you'll need is software and a microphone of some sort. Now, I found a super simple software that I use a lot and it's just easy to use and simple. Uh, there's no affiliate link here for this. It's what I'm using to make this video. It's called screen pal, right? They used to be called screencast o -Matic. and it's a super easy screen recorder. Okay. If you want to record your face, you can with a, you, you know, you get a little camera, you can do that. And it's just really easy and simple to use and they have a free version and also, but the pro version is so cheap. You know, what is it going now? I mean, like $4 and 50 cents a month to up to $7 and 50 cents a month. It really is inexpensive to use. Plus they have a free version. So you could try this out. So here's a super simple software. There are software out there with more effects, more things. I use Wondershare also. That's a good one, but that, that's more complicated to use. You can do it. Um, I use it, but this one you can get going right away and to start making videos really easy to edit as well. I, I really like it for the simplicity and the ease of use. So you can go ahead and start making videos about your experiences. Just say your niche is affiliate marketing in affiliate marketing and start uploading them to YouTube. Okay. I'm going to show you just a few basics here. Okay. Now when you make your video, should have like a call to action. What do you want the people to do? Do you want the people to join your newsletter? That's a good idea. Do you want people to buy a certain product or service? That's fine too. 
I opt more to building my audience and giving valuable information. So you should always ask people to subscribe to your YouTube channel. I've got this uh, little thing here. You just ask people in the video. You want to keep it simple. And also, you can come down here, of course, put your links in the description and fill out the description completely. But another thing is neat that you could do is you could do pinned comments. You come in here, you write a comment, and you say, hey, come here to join my newsletter. Here I'm promoting my ebook rebrander, but sometimes I promote my newsletter. Join my newsletter and get $597 of free software. Okay, and then I put the link to join the newsletter. You could put your landing page here. And the great thing about this, it stays up forever. And so, you know, you put one video up today, it's going to stay up for, for years, hopefully. And you can start building and building and building and have lots of this permanent media out there, building your list, building your audience. Okay. And you just come here and you click the pin. I already pinned it. So it says unpin. Um, and that is a little trick of the trade. Have a call to action. What you want people to do. Want people to subscribe to your uh, YouTube channel and you want people to join your newsletter or whatever it is you want to do. But I say, you know, why don't you build your audience and get people following you? And as long as you're authentic, it doesn't matter if you, you suck. You're going to suck. Okay. I suck. A lot of people suck, but the information is good and it's real. So be authentic and you'll be completely unique. If you're authentic, if you just get to a screen video, you don't have to show your face. All right. Don't worry about being perfect. Don't use AI voices. Use your own voice. Even if it's not that great, it's authentic. Talk to people about your experiences in your niche. So you'll have to do something. Here's some quick ideas on what you could uh, write about. If you want to promote the classifiedsubmissions.com program, you can come here and rebrand the ebook. We've got our rebrander re here. Come check this out. We have a rebrander to rebrand the list of classified ad sites where you can promote affiliate offers, do a video on how to rebrand it and do a video on how you're promoting the rebranded ebook. There you go. That's just one idea or talk about your experiences with classifiedsubmissions.com affiliate program. You could do that. You could use some of our software and show people how you're using it and give people ideas on how to use the software and what you're doing. So what I want you to do is to go out there and make some videos and start sucking with the rest of us. Okay. Just get in the action, get in the arena and start making videos and start doing them consistently all the time. And as you do it, you'll get better. And if you make some really sucky videos, but they're authentic and they're your voice, let me know and I will share them. Okay. I will share them. So, and I will comment on them and I will like them. All right. So, Go ahead. You can put them in the links to them in the comments. If you'd like to the, to the original videos that you've made, I don't care if they're good or not, but they have to be original, not just a, an AI uh, drone video. Okay. But with you talking for real authentic and I will comment on it and like it. Okay. So go ahead and get started. And I'd like to invite you to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'd also like to invite you to join my newsletter below by clicking the pinned comment below in this video. Thank you so much. This is Matthew May with quickregisterseo.com and classifiedsubmissions.com.